Nearly a year, I don't even know where you stay. I said, back off. Tattoo. I think someone is after me. What is it? What the? Based on the book by Dr. Abraham Wankwo. She has no hiding place. The long-awaited epic adventure movie under the auspice of Bank of Industry Paytrack Technologies and Film One Production and Distribution was premiered on Saturday, 22nd July at the Eco Hotel Convention Center. Celebrities in attendance include Desmond Elliott, Shago Arinze, Sambasa Nzerbe, to name a few. Check out moments from the premiere. I'm expecting the best from the movie. I want to see something from the, away from the normal, away from the usual, I love this, love that. I want to see something a bit real, you know, uh, uh, that's what I want. Those are my expectations, and I hope to be blown away at the end of the day. Well, I don't really have expectations. I'm just yet to see how it goes, and I know it will come out great, because when we get involved in stuff, it always comes out great. very excited because um, I'm actually in the movie. Yeah. I said uh, the body double for um, Rahama. And she's, from, she's from the north, so she couldn't do that part, so I was called to do it. The cast of the movie is already on point, so I'm hoping it will be as good as it looks on the outside. I see Nollywood these days as a, a place where it only gets better. So with Tattoo and with the cast, uh, I know they, they are all good. They are people who are, I call them uh, veterans and they will deliver. And uh, I just hope so. Not that I hope so. It is so. And, uh, I play the role of um, a guard. You know, and uh, along with uh, Donga, and uh, I think I I I really I enjoyed myself, and um, I believe that the film is going to come out well. Um, don't let me let the cat out of the bag, but I know that uh, when you anybody that watches the film today, we like to continue to watch it over and over and over again because it will inform, it will entertain. It will add value to the individual's life. Uh, so I consider everybody who are here to watch this film special. By the time they come out, they will feel specially fulfilled that they have come to watch the movie. Uh, a simple message all about love and being tenacious and believing in, in one's aspiration in life and what one wants to be. And also, that evil never triumphs over good. People have different aspirations, people have different intentions and motives of what they do in life. And, but how do you go about it? You go about it in a clean way or go about it in a dirty way? Um, it's just a simple story put together, simple godly story put together. I'm excited. I just want to watch the movie. I want to relax because it's been a stressful week and I just want to enjoy myself. Outstanding movie, which um, I trust Shagu Ariza anyway. So he's been in the industry for a while, so I know he's gonna kill it. Ah, oh, I think they have really improved a lot. You know, the kind of movies they shoot these days are very, very nice, and they're great movies. Yeah. It's tight. I saw the pictures. When I saw the pictures. I was really feeling like Kelechi, you're supposed to be on this movie. Where were you? Oh, you know, we're doing the casting and all that. And I had to start praying again against our village people because I really don't know. Sometimes those guys just. Fully when you know in them. So movie's going to be great. A lot of good actors. A lot of good stuff I've seen from the pictures and the trailer, the costume. I want to know why it's set like that. I did so many questions begging to be answered from me. So I just really want to see the movie. Honestly, I don't expect anything less. And I know I won't be disappointed. They shot in the forest and um, the makeup too was crazy. Um, effects and all is out of um, the ordinary. So, And then I had this an adaptation from a novel too. So. Definitely, that's what you just want to say, how it's been interpreted. And these days that people don't read anymore. So maybe if we convert a lot of our books into movies, at least they will watch and learn. Mm -hmm. okay. I played the role Kamani in the movie Ta Tattoo, T-A-T-U. And um, yes, uh, Kamani is the protector. Kamani is the warrior, you know, of the, the lead warrior of the community. And he's sent on this uh, supposed impossible tax and he has to deliver. You have to watch it to see if he delivers. And then, you know, from um, getting the script, I got the script uh, two months before shoot. 
especially because I had some preparations to do. Uh, the character had to uh, had just uh, like about five lines in the whole movie. So there were other things in terms of going to the gym to work out, um, learning expression, rehearsing, you know, improving myself, you know, on a daily basis towards the shoot. And then I, I expected the, the shoot to be very challenging, but getting on set, it was even worse. It was, uh, you know, when you are in this part of the world, this continent, this country, and you are just trying to, you see this beautiful story, because this is an adaptation of a book. You know, you see this beautiful story, and then you really want to do it and do it right, you know. Um, and then I came on set, and everything that, that hit me as an actor, I was like, I was going to see through it, you know. Uh, I shaved everything everything you are going to see it in my I shaved everything and then um, the filmmakers wanted the producers wanted to do it right so they needed a younger version of me in fact two younger versions of me so I had my nephew who has not acted before but now everybody said says that man this is the new guy in town you know his name is Dumebi in Zeribe and then I had um, Yinka you know to play another stage uh, in my growth so I would rather die than have Buru take my baby! The movie was very nice. Uh, I really enjoyed it. It was, uh, uh, it brought some authentic flavor. And uh, yeah, it was exciting to watch it. Big ups to the executive producer. That was, that, that was really great. And we hope that um, more Nigerian movies can have this kind of quality. I mean, this is something that you can take anywhere. It's, it's, it's Nigeria to the world. The, the movie is crazy. The movie is mad. I see the movies. You know when they say something is sweet, it's tasty. I still have it in my taste buds. You should really go see this movie when it comes out. I think I was looking forward to something like right here, but I got in there and it was just yeah, like yeah. That's what people want to see when it's yeah about a movie. It was lovely, properly well done. Uh, great acting, great costuming, great voice effect. The sound effects were like wow. I am Kamani, you know. You just live with it. I, oh, you see what I mean? You leave the hall and you just have that ringing in your head. It's a good thing when you see a movie like that.